Hey guys, what's up? It's Xupers here, and today I'll be reacting to episode 3 of Tradora. So let's go. Starting now. Alright, so that was a very interesting intro scene. Um, the two of them are kind of like an old married couple while they were walking. I mean, Takase is still pretty much crushing on Shieda Minori. It might take a while before they actually switch gears and, you know, shift their view from their old crushes to each other. It's gonna be a long journey. I think I think the fact that they are they are starting their relationship with a conflict will definitely strengthen their bonds later on. Okay, maybe not as quickly as possible, but like you know, uh, hopefully we get there uh, soon. <laughs> What? <laughs> 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 What does she actually feel about this, though? And this guy. <laughs> Bro. It's broken? How many part-time jobs is this girl doing? Oh. 
いつもあっ高須くん甘いの苦手だったらポテトフライにする盛るぜ超盛るぜ<笑>いやこれは<笑>コンビニとカラオケボックスでもバイトしてるんだよね。お前が。そんなに ?Poor part-time jobs? なんて女子ソフト部の部長としては部活も休めないですからな。そこまで働いて欲しいものでもあるの時間あるもん。勤労しなきゃ。勤労。そう、勤労回帰ファイルだよ。えよみがえる勤労だよそれにしても本当に仲いいよねお二人さんお姉さんお日やじゃあごゆっくりうん<笑><笑>笑顔がキラキラ輝いてるなーって。うん目,目はやめろ。これ以上は指が汚れる。くそ。でもどうしてあんなにバイトを掛け持ちしてるんだろうな。勤労回帰ファイルって言ってたじゃん。もしかして金が必要な理由があるんじゃないか。家のこととかさ。病気の母さん助けてるとか勤労って言ってたじゃないでもさんうんうんうんそういう思い込み捨てた方がいいよえこれだけに本当の彼女を分かってやれるってやつキモさに拍車かかるからあーやだやだちょっと離れて歩いてよね She's so jealous though ハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ
お前まさか自転車乗れないんじゃうっさーっ自転車に乗れないからって何だけど<笑><笑><笑><笑> That's one way of doing it 間違えてる間違えてるぞおーほとばしてるよタイガーすさまじいなまあ押していくなら安全かな、うん、あそうだ焼酎補充しなきゃなんだっけ And he just pipes up when he's next. Okay, now, she, now he's talking to her. Okay, foreshadowing. There we go. <laughs> oh my gosh! <laughs> Just as they were saying. Oh wow, she's done. Oh. Oof. That must have hurt bad. Well, at the very least, she finished her deliveries. And she was also pre dressed pretty cutely, too. Wait, what's the history between these two? Okay, what's that dual dude's deal with her? Because he obviously rejected her. Friends owned her, right? But what's with the what's what's with that? Why would you say that after rejecting her? That's kind of like making things confusing. And she's still conf she's actually confused about her feelings. I think. I think she's starting to develop feelings for Doxa. Interesting. You can get rid of the bars. Oh, 
だけじゃないのかもしれない。キラキラしてた出会った頃も今も一発輝いてるえ見つけて<笑>はい。All right, so the pairing of Taiga and Kitamura also doesn't work, I think. Or maybe that's just, that's, that's just me trying to make the Taiga Ryuji pairing work because that's where I feel like this story is going. But okay, even without that, Kitamura already rejected her, but he's saying things that are quite confusing. I don't know if she, well, she hasn't moved on, obviously, from him because she says she's not going to give up on him. But I don't think he will ever change his feelings toward her. It doesn't seem like it. It doesn't seem like he will ever view her in that way. So I think it's a bit pointless. Both of their crushes are a bit pointless because they just don't match. And they don't really spend a lot of time with those two, with those two either. They're always spending a lot of time with each other. So how can you expect to develop a Romantic relationship with someone with whom you don't spend a lot of time, right? So, those are just my some of my thoughts. Getting a part time job out of the blue was pretty, pretty sick. I, I, can, I can understand how Taiga feels or how, how she felt because why, why did she get herself involved in something like that out of the blue? I wouldn't want that at all. I would probably just say no and leave. But why did she stay? That's the question. Why did she stay and go along with it, right? It's possible that she's doing it. She kept on saying it as well. She doesn't understand why she keeps on trying. Trying what? So we don't know exactly what her feelings are right now, for especially with regard to Yuji. Does she, re does she like him now? Does she have feelings for him now? Did it start to bud? Is it being developed? Is that why went along with the whole thing, even though she knows, or even though she knew that Ryuji was doing it because he wanted to spend time with Kushida. It is what it is. They are young and in the springtime of their youth. They're just starting to, I guess, understand these feelings, these experiences of being in love. So I guess, I guess it's fine. It's fine for now. Anyway, so that's, that's、uh, episode three. I'll see you guys again in the next episode.